Good evening and welcome everyone. Mississippi may soon have a state lottery. The House voted to send a lottery bill to Governor Phil Bryant for his signature. WJTV 12's Gerald Harris is live now at the state capitol with reaction. Gerald. After some hurdles, the governor got what he wanted. After several moments of special sessions and talking behind doors, a special legislative session has been over. And however, disagreements are about where the lottery profits should end up or could end up and whether or not there should be a lottery at all. Democrats have called for lottery money to be spent on education while the speaker is strictly opposed to the lottery. But the author of the lottery bill maintains it is what the people of Mississippi if you want. Problem with some of the money going for infrastructure, but we think it's important that some of the money from the lottery goes to fund early education. Well, obviously, I'm disappointed because I was uh, I've been against it, you know, from the beginning. I think it's a bad policy. I, I've said that repeatedly, but I was also asked to let the process work, and I did. I've allowed the process to work, and this is the result. We've been working on this bill for several years now, and um, we. We think it's going to be a very positive impact, uh, impact on our state. Mississippi is a state in desperate need of funds. Lawmakers hope the lottery will generate enough profit to fix roads and bridges. Revenue be fun will be funneled towards infrastructure for 10 years or until $80 million is reached. At that point, monies will be redirected to education. This bill does also sets up a lottery corporation and it sets up a lottery corporation. And we might also have to add that the Senate will reconvene tonight to consider BP funding. Live at the State Capitol, Gerald Harris, WJTV 12.